Hi, my name is Adi from 7B. I am going to talk about my prototype showcasing precision agriculture. Currently, there are several problems impacting agriculture, such as the depletion of water, and effective use of pesticides, and predictable weather. So, what is the solution to these problems? Still, these problems can be addressed using information technology. So, precision agriculture is an approach to enhance farming by using IT to ensure that the plants are growing in the most effective way using the most minimum resources. So as you can see on this slide, there are many benefits, the key being the reduced use of waters and fertilizers. One of the most important features that affect plant growth is water. So I have used a moisture sensor on the plant. It has two electrodes. So by detecting where the current is passing in the electrodes, the moisture can be detected. So the moisture sensor is connected to a node in CU. So this can co communicate wirelessly to the raspberry pipe, which is a server. So the raspberry pipe runs MQTT. So MQTT is a messaging server used by the node MCU. It also runs Node-RED, which is a software used to visually display the information collected by the sensors and make decisions based on the inputs from the sensors. Farmers all can also capture the temperature, humidity and light in the region to gather hyperlocal weather information. So this can be used for crop rotation to obtain an optimal environment for the plant. So I have used a light temperature and humidity sensor. So this sen information is displayed in node red. So there is a um, humidity and temperature sensor which is in this module. Then this is an LDR or a light detecting resistor. So this detects the light in the area and changes its resistance. Now all of this information is sent to the node red using MQTT via the MCU which is here. So this is the node red dashboard where all of the values are displayed including temperature, light, moisture and humidity. This particular node MCU is used to control the pump to water the plant. It turns on and off the pump by using a relay. So this relay acts as a digital switch to turn on the pump. Based on messages received from the moisture sensor, the additional logic in node red determines when the pump should be turned on and off. As you can see, the soil in the plant is moist enough to hold enough water. But for demonstrative purposes, I will remove the moisture sensor which will trigger the um, pump to pump water. 